Rochester Fire Department will kick off this parade today. Good morning, Baron. Thank you very much for broadcasting and doing some PA work at the same time. Leading our parade, Rochester Fire Department that provides fire protection for a large area of Fulton County, including the city of Rochester, all Rochester Township, the south half of Newcastle Township, and east half of Richland Township. They specialize in firefighting suppression, auto extrication, and first responded using the BLS rescue truck. They have 14 first respondents they're called out to assist the EMS when needed. Rochester Fire Department prides itself in fire prevention program. They do that in schools during the month of October. They're always there when someone comes by so they can show off those big red fire trucks. Ladies and gentlemen, the Rochester Fire Department. And don't forget, smoke detectors do save lives. The Lutheran EMS of Fulton, Jennifer Galloway, Fulton County EMS Director, has been in her position since March of 2010. She currently resides in Fort Wayne, but was born and grew up in Argus after graduating from Argus Community High School. She's gone to numerous colleges. Finally ending up at Indiana University South Bend, Lutheran EMS of Fulton County just passing by our reviewing stand. Okay, morning right. Sue. Well, we seem to not be minding the gap here. <laughs> little, little, well, just a slight gap in the parade this morning. Gap. <laughs> Coming up next will be the Rochester Police Department with Police Chief Andy Schatz, who grew up in Rochester, graduated from Rochester High School in 95, attended Vincennes University through 97 with a major in law enforcement. And he's been in the Rochester Police Department for over 17 years, becoming police chief in May of 2014. They serve and protect the Rochester Police Department. And here they come. And we have the Kiwana Police Department as well. Welcome them, 2015 Police Interceptor, their local police and service, this town of Kiwana. Nice to have them in the parade today. Welcome. Next up, Fulton County Veterans Honor Guard. They'll be coming our way. The American Legion and the VFW joined forces to create the Fulton County Veterans Honor Guard. Please stand as we play the Star Spangled Banner.
The Honor Guard also performs military rites at the funerals of Fulton County veterans as well as performing other services within Fulton County. Welcome, nice to have you here. Thank you, gentlemen. And here's to our hometown heroes. Fulton County Veterans Honor Guard, ladies and gentlemen. All right, as we're broadcasting live from downtown Rochester, waiting now for the next entry, which is the 2017 Parade Grand Marshal. And that would be Jenny Nutter. Mm -hmm. Ah. Just reading ahead a little bit there, Tom. <laughs> have a bit of a gap. Next up, we will honor the 2017 Parade Grand Marshal, the 2017 Fulton County Community Service Award recipient is Channing Utter, which entitles him to be this year's Grand Marshal of the Living Local Fest Parade. It is, by the way, put on by the Fulton County Chamber of Commerce. From a young age, Channing worked in the family business. He graduated from a local high school, attended Indiana University, where he received a business degree with honors. Later, upon completion of his service in the United States Army, Channing returned home to the family business where he helped reach an international market with four production sites across Indiana. Channing and his company have developed and cared for a community park for over 50 years. He was a driving force behind the Community Economic Development Group that focused on important projects, including replacement of downtown buildings, the planting of hundreds of trees along Rochester and Mishawaka Streets in Akron. Channing is also an active member of his church in the Fulton County Community Foundation. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2017 Fulton County Community Service Award recipient Mr. Channing Utter. Rochester High School Marching Band is slated to be our next group. They're coming down. Help us welcome the Rochester High School Marching Band. And they're going to be playing one of your favorite songs, Limbo Rock. So if you'd like to get out of Limbo, feel free. Sticks provided. What's that? Sticks provided. Yep. <laughs> we went to Limbo this morning on Main Street. Rochester High School Band is up next. They're about to our vantage point. Limbo Rock. Here we go. Limbo Rock.
job. Rochester High School Band, ladies and gentlemen. Good job, thank you. Kroger Company is up next, enjoying a bonfire with their Kroger friends and family while roasting marshmallows and hot dogs. Some trying to catch some fish. They're all trying to feed the human spirit. Kroger of Rochester, welcome to the parade. Nice to have you with us. Nice float, good job. Hey, good job, Kenny. Kenny. <laughs> Coming up next is Operation Christmas Child. New Life Church encourages everyone, churches and families, to shop locally to pack a shoebox for Operation Christmas Child. Operation Christmas Child is a wonderful way to bless children in over 100 countries around the world with items purchased right here in Fulton County. Start shopping early to get those summer and back to school sales. New Life Church will be an additional shoebox drop-off location in November 2017. How about a nice hand for the folks from Operation Christmas Child? Oh, the crowd is picking up a bit. It is picking up a bit here in downtown Rochester. As we just mentioned, Operation Christmas Child and New Life Church will be an additional shoebox drop off location in November of 2017. They do a wonderful job. Mm -hmm. They really do. Our community is a very giving community. It is. Nice float from New Life Church. Well done. Some work into that. They've got cram boxes and all the things that needs to go in these shoe boxes, and obviously they put a lot of work into it. Top Industries is next. The industry leader at sewage sump and wastewater products manufactures high quality, environmentally responsible products, including fiberglass, polyethylene, and structural foam basins, tanks, lift stations, accessories, and more. Yes, indeed, right here in Rochester. Top is proud to grow its roots in Fulton County, providing over 110 jobs and continuing to grow. Summer for Top means it's busy season, so Top invites you to help them build for the future by applying today. How about a nice hand for Top Industries in the parade today? And we're gonna follow that with Top Performance Race Parts, proud to be part of Fulton County and representing an important piece of Rochester's history, the Gertie Engine brand. Top Performance Race Parts provides a wide selection of inventory and products for dirt, asphalt, and road racing. Top Performance Race Parts is proud to continue the Gertie name in our line of high-quality Gertie engines by Top. Summertime means racing time. Stop by, see their new home, 601 Monroe Street in August for their open house. More details to be announced soon. Top Performance Racing Parts. Fulton County Democrats coming along next. Fulton County Democratic Float is entitled, Thank a Democrat for Social Security, Minimum Wage, 40-Hour Work Week, Overtime Pay, Unemployment Compensation Act, Agricultural Extension Service, GI Bill of Rights, Medicare, Operation Head Start. These are some of the reasons living locally in Fulton County is good, so thank a Democrat. Democratic Party is headed by the chairperson, Phyllis Binninger, Vice Chair Jim Shalley, Secretary Dixie Good, Treasurer Tony Scott, they invite the public to the John F. Kennedy dinner held on July 22nd at the Jackson Family Estate. Don't forget to support Senator Joe Donnelly in the 2018 election. Fulton County Democrats, ladies and gentlemen. And I must add that there is a little white dog prancing along <laughs> and a praise dog. RTC Connections, the communication leader in our community for well over 120 years. RTC Communications, local service, local support, local investment. New Holland Rochester, New Holland TA Tractor with Coon Spreader from New Holland Rochester, representing our rural farming community here in Fulton County. As spring begins, so does the field work, continuing through summer and into the fall harvest. Tractor is being driven by Dan Snipes in the spreader and potential future farmers of Fulton County. 
New Holland Rochester proudly supports our local community, and they would like to say thank you to all who make Fulton County a great place to call home. Coming along next, we have the Rochester Lions Club, Lions Club International, celebrating its 100th anniversary this year. Club's motto, of course, is we serve. Rochester Lions Club, very active in the community. They always welcome men or women who are interested in joining. Cars being driven by Rod Bird. He's accompanied by Phil McCarter. The one and only Phil McCarter. <laughs> The Indiana Racing Lions will be coming along next. They perform to serve humanity through their community-centered state, national, and international projects. They represent the largest service organization in the world with membership of over 1,358,000 men and women. 46,434 clubs, 747 districts, 208 countries and geographic areas. Some of the projects in Indiana alone include the Eye Bank, Leader Dog for the Blind, Cancer Control, Speech and Hearing, Indiana School for the Blind and Visually Impaired, and Building Ramps for the Disabled. Several times each year, the Indiana Alliance travel to third world countries to personally fit pairs of eyeglasses at no charge to the recipient. Last year, over 750,000 eyeglasses were distributed. Membership in the Lions Club is by invitation only to those who wish to volunteer serve others through their many projects. Indiana Racing Lions, ladies and gentlemen. That's what I want to do when I, if I ever reach that right? Yeah. You'll we'll be good at that. Those guys have so much fun driving those little cars around, and they clearly know what they're doing. Here comes the Fulton County Republican Party under the leadership of Chairman Chad Hartzler. We welcome them to the parade this morning as well. Nice elephant. State Representative Jack Jordan with us as well. Welcome. Following the Republican Party, Woodlawn Hospital, the employees of Woodlawn Hospital have been committed to provide excellent health care services by highly skilled staff in a compassionate and caring manner for, that's right, over 100 years. Woodlawn Hospital also has physician offices, Argus, Akron, and Fulton. They offer a variety of services for pediatric care, family care, rehab services, orthopedic services, surgical services, oncology services, OBGYN services. What would our community be without Woodlawn Hospital? Welcome. Can't say that enough times. Of course, we have a lot of good we things do. in our community, services, and just makes you very, very proud. The Life Skills Kingdom Come Puppets coming up. With the Lutherans presented by St. John's Kingdom Come Puppets, we welcome them to the parade. Nice float, you guys. Good job. The puppets are really awesome. They, are, it, they put a lot of effort yes, to they get did. into this. A lot of time um, and effort. It's a castle with some puppets doing their thing, talking, having a great time. Superior Auto Incorporated. Good credit, bad credit, no credit. Need to travel, no need to travel to the big city for your transportation needs. Drive your way at Superior Auto. They've been serving the hard-working local citizens of Rochester, believe it or not, for over 20 years. Stop in or call, speak to Marissa, get the best deals in town. Shop local today, Superior Auto. Fulton County Historical Power Association. They hold the power show the third weekend in June. They did it last week, it was a great show. They also have members that dance in the Lily Pearl Tractor Square Dancing Group. They'll be performing in several local fairs in July. Watch for the fair schedules. Nice tractor, Jim. Talk about shiny tractors. Jeez, yes. they're like showroom quality. Fulton County Historical Power Association. Got to turn on your mic, Amy. Amy Rowe here, and she's the executive director of Fulton County Chamber of Commerce. Good morning, everybody. I think so. No, it's not. Keep talking. Yeah, they can hear you. 
This is the PA. Let's do the PA too. Go ahead. Okay, we're broadcasting a WROI. It has been the first living local fest parade. What do you think? I think it was the most enjoyable Saturday morning. I think they <laughs> did a great job. I think people need to understand, anytime you kick off a new event for your community, it gets it gets bigger right. and better every, every year. And I admire the chamber. They're trying different things, mixing it up. But it's a beautiful morning. There's lots to do down here. And here in just a little bit, the Living Local Fest will begin. It will. It'll be kicking off here shortly. So we want to thank you for listening to our broadcast this morning.